Hello everyone to our last lesson in Photoshop which will be about material preparation for any 3D or any modeling software. Now today we will be fixing some four materials, okay? Let's take one for example and insert it to Photoshop. Okay, great. As you can see that this material is a little bit ruined and it's not uh, taken like this shot isn't taken correctly okay so for this one I'm going to fix all this um, dirt over here then fix the material in general now I will be using the last or the previous tool we learned which um, was the stump tool okay Let's press S and I will be choosing to copy from this. Hold the Alt, choose some area or hit on some area, and there you go. That's it. I'm holding the Alt and copying this area carefully. Okay, that's great. Now let's remove this dirt over here. Hold the Alt, choose. As we mentioned, you have to be really careful while copying because, as you can see, that the target that you are copying from is moving. Okay, great. Awesome. Now. For this one, I'm going to use, um, uh, if you remember, the Perspective Crop Tool. Okay, so I'm going to fix this using Perspective Crop Tool. Hit Enter or OK, and there you go, here our material. Now, if we went to Edit, Define Pattern, hit OK. Going to add button here in order to see the frequency of this material. Let's check it out. Okay, as you can see, guys, that it is so ready to be used in any rendering or 3D model or software. Okay, now let's hit OK and try on another material, which will be some wallpaper. Now, in this case, uh, as you can see that this material or this pattern is quite hard to fix, okay? Like, uh, as you can see that there are different shapes or something. In my case, I will be doing a new um, pattern, okay? I will create a new pattern out of this one. Now, I will go to crop, the normal crop tool, and do this, actually. You see guys, in my case I will create this one as the new pattern, hit OK, go to edit, define pattern, OK, go to the other one, change the pattern to this one, and that's it. You notice that our wallpaper is so ready to be used, it's a whole new pattern and it's cool it's continuous that's awesome okay let's try another method go there to photoshop okay great now how can i check this material actually you can go to filter other than offset okay as you can see that there are two offsetting sliders so the first one is horizontal the second one is vertical let's move to the horizontal and see the result as you can see that this is the place where these two materials meet in the middle 
Now, how can we fix such thing? You just gotta pick up the brush tool, okay? Now, I hit hold the alt and choose um, from this blue area in order to paint this place that you are going to fix now. So I'm totally removing um, the ruined part of this material. You can also remove this one. Okay, right. Now how can we fix this? Using the stamp tool. Now let's go here and maybe copy this one. Make sure that the brush is just as this point. I mean the same size. Let me copy it again. Okay, going to copy this one. Here maybe. Good. Um, here for example. And here. Some couple of yellow points. That's okay, don't mind this one. Okay, great. Now let's fix the other side. Go to offset and so set it on zero, then move the vertical one. And here is my ruined area. Take the brush and paint over this part. Okay, that's awesome. Pick the stump tool. Actually, I will copy this to here. This one. Maybe to here. Okay, that's good. Let's add some yellow points. Okay, awesome. Now let's define it as a pattern and go check it out. Whoa, amazing. There is no single difference. Now this material is probably ready to be used. Now the last one is the grass material. Let me grab this one here and check filter other offset as you can see guys that there is a central line separating these two materials actually i'm going to slide this one as well to see the other side and hit ok now in this case i would probably use the marquee tool select this ruined area and right click inside the selection fill now I will be using for the content, I'm going to use the content aware which will be copying um, the, sur this, the surrounding area into this one in addition to some fixes. So this one is probably a good option but keep in mind that it doesn't work every time on any material. Okay guys, so let's just give it a try. Hit OK and wait for a second. It's analyzing. Okay. 
and great amazing so clean so pure let's hit the other one right click fill content aware okay go for it wait for a second and the magic will happen any minute Let's see. Oh, this is awesome. Whenever you see some area that is not really fixed, you can fix it on your own using the stamp tool as well. For example. Okay, amazing. Now edit the fine pattern. Okay, let's check it out. Um the grass one. Wow, that's just perfect. Just perfect. As you can see guys, that there is no single difference between any two sides of the material. Now let's hit OK. That's everything for today's lesson anyone. Thanks for watching and hope this course was useful and you were following me step by step. Now, in my case, I will be doing some other courses, so stay tuned guys, thanks for watching, see ya!